All right, discuss item number 15. Discuss, take action on invoice pertaining to Southwest Architects. Case be uh, incorporated. I believe this is probably you, Richard. Do you have the paperwork? Yes, yes, sir. sir. We have a bill for the Southwest Architects on the jail. Um, we're doing the jail and the patent sale. Now, this was, this was budgeted for last year, the last year's budget. And looking at everything and trying to get all the subcontractors together, uh, this gentleman built our jail, so and he's familiar with it. He had to redo his architectural work to fit it. There was some. There was another issue that came up in a pipes system, which checks on the prisoners, uh, and it, it actually has a clock that's installed and as they as they go by to do a check it, it time stamps it to the exact time so uh, we were actually out of compliance with Sandra Blandang and uh, as far as holding the prisoners if you want to talk a little bit about that you can. Well that pipe system is just an electronic because we do cell checks you know, every hour, and it's just instead of writing them down, the times down, which can be fudged or or miswritten or misread, it's an electronic timestamp. It's just kind of upgrading the system to where there's no doubt that that you know that cell was checked at that time. So it potentially protects our officers. Protects us liability-wise. Right. Protects our officers, and two, it can integrate with the camera system, right? That shows the the jailer actually looking in the window as they check it to prove that they are actually looking at the cell too. That's what I mean by protection. Yeah. The bill is for uh, his paperwork being sent down and him having to do all this work. We had originally budget, budgeted 80000 for the job, but in looking at it and finding all these other issues, uh, he's bumped it up uh, to uh, 151575. Um, the paperwork has arrived in Austin and has to be reviewed by jail standards. Um, that's the last email that I that I received. I don't know if you got that or not. Alan. I did, and it's yeah. actually on, on the desk there now. And that's standard. They have to review, by law, they have to review any additions. And, and the issue was really. we get the contractors together. There's only a couple companies that make that. But, um, it's not really foam. It's a, it's not padded either. Um, it's like a hard plastic. Yeah. Softer than plastic, but anyhow, there's only a couple companies that make that uh, interior of the of the cell. Um, what goes in the cell? So, and getting all them lined out. He said that, did he, did he tell you that he'd be done this, this budget year? Oh, it's, yeah, the hardest part is, is getting this uh, check off from the state. And they'll do a review call at, after that with him, and then the process starts. This current bill, Michelle, to Southwest Architects is for $11,729.16. And we set aside this year a capital improvements expansion in two or three different line items. In that line item, we put one point five million. That is the six eighty five forty one. I'm sorry, six eighty five forty one. Capital improvements expansion projects, which was going to uh, cover part of the fire department and the sheriff's department. I didn't mean to interrupt you. I didn't oh, okay. You want to say it all? Well, do I have a motion to move forward to paying this bill to Southwest, <laughs> Southwest Architects for $11,729.16? I have a motion by Richard. Do I have a second? I'll second it. I have a second by Tammy. Any further questions? Just no, we just approved an architectural work. The other price is still where it was. Yeah, so we come. <laughs> yeah. That's still, that'll be brought back to us, approved as he progresses with his project. All right, so I have a motion and I have a second. All in favor said motion. That's five.